friends, welcome to my to Create of Unique Treasures. I'm Trisha and I'm working on the dresser, the ever ending, never or the never ending dresser. And um, what I'm going to do today is I'm going to, or right now, I'm going to touch up all the lilac, rust oleum lilac paint on here. Um, my drawers sit in a little bit. So I need to paint around here in the lilac. Do some touching up. So that's what I'm gonna be doing. I'm gonna go get a wipey to wipe in case I get any on the goal. So I have these wipeys right here, they're just they're just uh, an off-brand cleaning disinfectant wipey. That way I don't get any on the gold. I think maybe my paintbrush might be just a little too big. I might go grab another smaller one and go a little slower. Make it a, more of a mess. I don't want to have to touch up the gold on top of everything. Okay, that's I just got my eyes dilated about two hours ago. I think I'm kind of still a little bit blurry. Just want to make it a little bit more neater. All right, let's check that out and see how that looks. in a little bit then it will show up this ugly rough edge right here so yeah so I'm gonna go ahead and do that that piece of wood all the inside the um, framing of the door drawers and then I'm gonna go over here and do this up make it look neater at this right here. So it looks neater if the drawers get inset a little bit or are pulled out a little bit. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do that and then I'll come back and I'll show you. What I got done on the dresser, I was I was gonna touch up all this, all this right here with the lilac, Rust-Oleum lilac. And let me see if I can zoom in a little bit. And so that's what I got done so far. And I got it all along right here, and all along there, and right through there, just to make it a little bit more neater. And now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and all the um, gold that I've got going on right here, I have to touch that all up and add another coat to that. So I'm going to do that. And I got the gold going around, all around the, the front of the drawers, and all the way down through there. So that's what I'm going to be doing next. After I get done with that, let me see if I can move the um, move the dresser around and then show you the drawers because I'm going to be doing I'm going to be doing the uh, drawers here's the drawers on this side over here they're all out of the dresser as you can see and 
what I need to do to the drawers now is I'm going to go around and zoom in a little bit more. And I'm going to go ahead and on the bottom of the drawers, I'm going to go ahead and paint. If you can see that, I hope you can see that. I'm going to go ahead with the lilac and make that nice and neat. And then on the sides, I'm going to be stenciling. I'm going to stencil something on the natural wood. Probably the same design that I did on the dresser. On the dresser here. That I did. So I'm just going to do something on, nat on the natural side. And uh, just to dress it up a little bit and add something. I might end up having to paint it. Well, I'll find out. We'll find out about that. But that's, yeah, I just wanted to let you know what I'm up to. And uh, if you can uh, subscribe, if you like this content, I'd, we would appreciate you subscribing and liking and giving me, like I said, give me a comment. Um, let me know what you're working on. Thank you, and God bless you. And I'm working on the dresser that we're doing. And what I'm doing, I'm going to be doing the drawers today. And I'm going to be painting the sides because they're kind of messed up. And I want to paint them with the uh, Rust-Oleum Rust chalk paint in the, in the color lilac, and which is the color that's on here, the main color. And I want to paint, paint the sides and then I'm going to stencil. So there will be a nice little surprise for the person who purchases it. And um, so that's what we're doing. And I have four drawers that I have to do. Let me see if I can pan, pan the camera around. There's the four drawers. And so yeah, that's what I'm going to be doing. Thank you for joining me. And um, don't forget to subscribe. We really appreciate you. So I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to be using my dusty the dusty uh, brush, it's called the dusty, and mine is pretty pretty wore out. Um, I probably need a new one, but I haven't got around to using that. I'm gonna use it till I can't use it no more. So I thought I'd come on here to show you the progress that we're doing here. Or the, what we're trying to make, make progress here. So, like I said, I'm going to just be slapping this on. I don't know. And then I think I, what I'll do is I'll I'll show you this this first drawer, and then I'll just come back when it's all done and show you the show you when they're done. So I'm sure you don't want to sit here and watch me paint. I was going to leave the sides of the drawers, the wood, but the, they're kind of messed up a little bit, so I figured I was just going to leave it natural wood and then just stencil and make it look like, you know, more natural, but they're pretty, they're pretty messed up, like this one right here. Kinda has, you know, something. I mean, I cleaned it all off, but that that won't come off. So I figure a nice coat of paint will look a lot better. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do this to eight. Well, there's four drawers, so it'll be eight sides, and then I'll come back and show you when I'm done with this. How it turned out. Thanks for joining me. Right now, I'm taking the drawers out. Took the drawers out, and I'm gonna. I went ahead and put the Rust-Oleum lilac on the um, sides of the drawers, and I went ahead. Sorry about that. Went ahead and stenciled. 
stencil on each of them on the sides of the drawers. So that's what I'm doing. Show you all four of them here. All four. And now I'm going to go ahead and show you what's, what I'm doing. And so let me see if I can bring it up closer without the glare on there. It's very subtle. I use the uh, rose, rosy um, metallic paint by Dixie Belle. That's the paint I used. So I'm going to go ahead and turn it around this way. Pencil. Dixie Bell Moonshine without me spilling it. The lid is off. There we go. Just going to show you real fast. I'm not going to have you see the whole thing all of the drawers but I just wanted to show you I'm dabbing my paint and then I'm taking most of it off it's kind of like a dry brush Did, um, I did do uh, just about three or four of these on this drawer. I did all of them a little different to have some variety going on because every drawer is different anyway so that's why I was thinking go ahead and put I shouldn't have picked this one up, but I did. Just lay it back down, line it up. There we go. And the next step I'm going to do is stamping. And then I'm going to seal it up and I'll be done. I am um, got all the paint, the trim painted up and touched up. So then. I'm going to do that to the rest of the dressers, or the rest of the drawers for the dresser. So let me see, let me see if I can zoom down and show you that closer. There, it's a little bit better, it's a bit weird angle. But it's, it's kind of faint, but it's on there. You can, you can definitely see it in person. Let me see if I can go over and give you a shot of all the, all the dressers, or all the drawers. If I could talk, only talk. I could only talk, see. It's, as it dries, it gets a little darker. Like there's the front of it, the, dress, the drawer, the dresser. All right, <laughs> thanks for joining me, and um, I'll be seeing ya. Come back and join me. I'll be doing the stamping next. Have a blessed day.